Hey guys, it's me, Boog. And Dad. Hey, today we're going to be reviewing the Home Accents Holiday Great uh, Five Foot Grave and Bones Animated LED Hearse. Yes, it's finally time. <laughs> we have obtained the Holy Grail. Finally. Yes, of Home Depot decorations. So uh, this is the box. It is, oh, my trash trailer now, so I to excuse the mess. But it is pretty huge, so I'd advise if you're able to get one of these, uh, definitely take a truck. But um, without any further ado, let's get to the review. Back. All right, yeah, so here it is, folks. We've already assembled it. Um, First disclaimer, the ho the pony is not included. Right, right. Yeah, we have a separate review on the channel for that. Linked in the, at, the end of the, uh, at the end of the video. Yeah, but we did it separate because, like Boogie said, it's not included. It's a separate purchase. It's designed to go with it, but a separate purchase. So, yeah, look for that video if you want to because for this one, we're, gonna, we're going to um, concentrate on the five-foot animated Hirsch otherwise known as the holy grail <laughs> of home dun, depot dun. yes decorations um wow this is it folks like i said i've been wanting this thing for years it's the first time i laid eyes on it um didn't think it was gonna be possible because normally uh when they discontinue something it doesn't come back usually there's a reason they discontinued it you know problems with the manufacturer different manufacturer uh, who knows didn't sell well you know got too expensive to make well you know there's tons of different decisions to go into producing these things year after year um so like i said when it, it came about 2019 or 2020 um for the one season and then it never returned um so of course like i said um on social media all that kind of thing it went kind of viral um and turned into this big ordeal uh where you know of course everybody wanted one and you know the seasons rolled by and they weren't producing them uh, they weren't showing up from year to year so uh the prices you know on the resale sites facebook marketplace ebay um you know all those type of places you know got just really really crazy 1500 2000 plus uh if you were lucky enough to have one of these and um you know like i said most of us really thought that they would never you know produce this again like i said because they just usually don't go back after they've stopped making something but little did we know about uh the middle of july a couple of days before Dun, dun, dun. Um, they kind of just soft announced it. Hey, Hearst is back. <laughs> so, of course, the masses went wild and uh, they had their uh, online pre order type uh, thing, like I said, mid July. And me and Boo just happened to be on there at the right time. I believe this guy and the ponies they had to go with it sold out in less than five minutes, <laughs> as you can imagine. Um, so, uh, but like I said, yeah, still just hugely, hugely popular. Uh, but the good news is they are going to have, they have these in stores. I've been to four or five of our local Home Depots. I've seen them there on the top racks. Most of our places are not selling just yet, but they look like they all have at least four or five of these each. So uh, there's a chance if you really want one, like I said, scout out your, uh, your local Home Depots. Um, and, uh, you know, like I said, we're, we're probably into D-Day as far as the day that most of them are going to release. Most places are saying like, August 26th, which sounds good to me. I believe they'll get it up before Labor Day. Uh, matter of fact, they've announced on their Twitter channel, Home Depot has, is that all their stores will be set up, you know, at the end of August. So we're getting close here. What are we on, Boo? Like 17th, 18th? Yeah. So, yeah. 18th. So like I said, if you're interested in this, it's now's the time to start stalking your Home Depot because uh, this will go super, super fast. If not, just for the people that want them. And of course, the scalpers, you know, like I said, because the pinup demand for this guy is just so, so big. Well, you could take a look at me and Dad's uh, inside, uh, inside the store look at, at Home Depot, also linked at the end of the video. Absolutely. All right, so let's get to this review. All right, well, number one, like I said, this is just a whole old style, you know, horse drawn Hirsch. Uh, it is made of completely of plastic, but it's the normal SVI heavy duty plastic that we normally have been getting from them since, like you said, since since old Skelly debuted, uh, you know, four or five years ago. And uh, like I said, it's very, very, very well made. Looks tremendous. You get two skeletons with it. One of them's the driver, comes with this little cape, and he is, uh, he's actually animated. Um, and we'll have, I'll go ahead and press the button so we don't have to stand over here. He's not wearing shoes, but this is what he, he does. The graveyard is not far. I and my trusty mayor will take you to the gate. <laughs> and 
and that's it. One phrase, it's not motion activated or anything. Uh, like I said, I don't think, I don't see a sensor anywhere on it. Um, all you have is this right here to make it go off. And I, wait, I would think it would be motion activated, I, I would think. But, um, but no, no, actually it has the switch down here, uh, back in here. So underneath this hat, and it's battery operated only. It does not have, you know, electrical connection. But I think with the switch, it's either a push pad, which would be this a little thing that you do get with it, or the other switch is just constant on, uh, where he just repeats himself over and over. But uh, like I said, that's probably the only drawback I have with it is that, you know, like I said, it is battery operated. But then again, I mean, like I said, that's all he really says. So doing something like this or getting one of those real official kind of like push pads would probably be better. Um, and it does, like I said, obviously have a place you can plug that in at. Um, and you know, that works out fine for what it does. But let me go ahead and just kind of start showing you the details here. As you can see, uh, it looks so amazingly good. Now, the cool thing about this is it's on its own complete stand, as you can kind of see back there. So it is not setting on these plastic wheels, uh, even though these wheels feel very durable. So you don't have to worry about it breaking because it is actually resting on that metal frame that's underneath. Uh, assembly was not too, too bad. It took me and mom probably 30, 40 minutes, something like that. Uh, directions are pretty straightforward. Everything goes together well. Um, these lanterns here, here and on this side over here, they both light up and you have a separate uh, push button for them. And you won't be able to tell, you can kind of see it light up there. You may have to come back in the dark and get a, a video, but they both light up. And with that same push button, you get the interior light of the Hirsch here, which is right up there. And I believe it's just the one. And he's going to eliminate uh, our dearly departed here in the Hirsch. <laughs> so, and this is just a uh, five foot uh, skeleton here, you know, kind of like you get the posables uh, and it does come with it. And you have these little levers here that pop up and there's also another one right here. So I guess you could kind of position them in there uh, either way you wanted to. So that part is really cool. But yeah, like I said, just look at this detail. This is plastic, but it looks so much like wood. And then on the inside, you can see the latches there and that's kind of how it all latches together. But yeah, if you look at it closely, you can see why people just love this. Absolutely awesome amount of detail here. And like I said, this is pretty stuff, pretty sturdy plastic. Love the way these are painted, the curtains are painted. Just plastic, but it looks, looks like the real thing without having to worry about them getting destroyed. And we'll go right here to the back. It's got these little ornament things on the side. And we just can't win today with our review. Neighbors coming to blow the leaves. And here it is from this side. But yeah, like I said, just absolutely awesome. Probably one of my favorite pieces that we have. Uh, just so, so cool. Totally love it. Boo, you got anything else to add? Uh, nope, we'll be back with nighttime shots. Absolutely, like I said, hope you enjoyed the review. Uh, the five foot animated Hearst from Home Depot. We'll be right back. We'll see you soon. Bye bye. Now we're back. <clears throat> yes. So, oh, of course, and it goes off. So we just come out here. It's evening time. It's not dark, dark, but I think it's dark enough to where you can see the lights, how they work and light up. Yeah, you can kind of see them there. So they light up and they flicker, which is very cool. Now they do have a constant mode, so if you have on this push button like we do at the moment, uh, they only stay on for just, you know, I don't know what, 20, 30 seconds? Yeah. But they do have a constant mode where you can switch that on and they'll just stay on um, pretty much until your batteries die or <laughs> you turn them off. Um, but like I said, for the lights, I'm definitely gonna get one of those uh, battery converters so that I can have them where they plug in. And like I said, they're on Amazon for like 12 or 13 bucks. Um, and then they'll just be on my regular timer for everything else and come on and run, you know, on the timer like everything else and then go off. So that's the way I plan to do those. But I think him, I'll probably just leave him on 
the batteries. I don't know. I'll think about it. I haven't quite made up my mind yet. But anyway, that's it. Uh, that'll finish up the review uh, for the Hearst, the 700 subscriber special. Thank you guys very much. We're almost to like 710 now. <laughs> so appreciate it. If you like these videos, don't forget to like and share. That definitely helps us out a ton. And we'll see you in the next one. Make sure you like, subscribe, everyone. Bye.